Hi everyone, in this video we are going to show you how to set a transparent menu. Since when you import demo contents or theme options your menu will be transparent, like most of the demo concepts from the Encode demo, I'll explain what the possible errors for not transparent menu might be. First of all, note that menu transparent is not available if you are using the center menu layout. That is a particular old-fashioned style menu layout that doesn't support transparency. And of course, it's not available if you use the vertical menu, where the menu is presented in a lateral layout. Apart from these two menu layouts, the menu can be transparent for all the overlay and off-canvas layouts, and for all the horizontal menu layouts. Second possible cause of menu not transparent is that you are not using a header. In Uncode, menu transparency works if you have applied a proper header. The first row of the page is not a header, and no special functionalities for menu transparency will be available. This is only the first row of the page content. Note that there is also an admin notice inside the admin, if you have not closed it. Headers are always external to the page, unless you don't use the simple basic header that is declared in the page options. So, please make sure you have connected a header to your page through the theme options or page options. If you have created a header design inside the page, please just move it to an external content block and apply this content block as the header of your page. You can copy your row thanks to the clipboard features, create a new content block, insert a title, in this case, my new header, paste the row that you copied, and save the content block. Now you can go back to the page and set in the page options header the new content block, my new header. Save the page. That's it. Now the page is using a real header and the menu is transparent. Moreover, you will see how it becomes advantageous for organizations and scalability to have dynamic external headers content block that can be used across multiple pages and that can be designed with back-end page builder or front-end page builder. Similar to the previous example, since Uncode 2.3.0, there is also a new header option named First Row as Header. As explained, the first row is never the header of a page unless you specify it in the page options. Applying a header type like the basic header, named default header in recent versions of Uncode, the content block header, or using the new first row as header option. I activate the header first row option. Let's save the options and go to check the page. Here we are. As you can see, the first row is now treated as a header and special functions like the transparent menu are applied correctly. Third possible cause of menu not transparent is that you have deselected it from theme options. If your menu is not transparent, make sure you have not selected the option to remove the transparent menu from the theme options. In fact, for each template of the single and of the archives groups of options, so for pages, portfolio, blog, posts, products, and any extras custom post types, you have the control to deactivate the transparency of the menu. This setting is useful if, for example, you want to create sections of your website that don't have the menu transparency. In this case, I'm using a page, so I open the page settings, I deactivate the options, save theme options, refresh the page, here we are with a transparent menu. Fourth possible cause of menu not transparent is that you have deselected it from page options. Please note that you have a setting to deactivate the transparency also inside every page or post. 
Inside your page options, at the very bottom of your page, at the tab menu, you have the Remove Transparency option. This option allows you to exclude transparency for individual pages. It is very useful if you only need to create one page without transparent menu. I set to Off. I save the page. I refresh the page. And here is our transparent menu again. Another possible cause your menu is not transparent is that you have not configured a transparent menu. In fact, in Theme Options, Customize, Light and Dark Skins, you have an option to set a transparent or semi-transparent value for the Primary Menu Background Opacity option. Make sure you have selected at least a semi-transparent value for both skins. In this example, the menu is not transparent because no transparency or semi-transparency value is applied. I modify the value, I save the theme options, and the menu is transparent. Last possible cause of menu not transparent is that you are using an advanced content block header created with a posts or media gallery module and you have not removed the content padding. Note that all our examples, the main image was a background. A background by default extends in its area to cover the available space. In this example, the images are not background but complex page contents, in this case, blog posts. Unless specified, Uncode adds a top content padding to avoid possible overlaps between contents and possible transparent menu. The menu is transparent, but the content padding pushes the content below the menu to avoid possible overlap problems. Consider this is something like a safety preset of Uncode. So if you are in this scenario, just remember to activate the No Content Padding and No Content Padding Mobile option in the Page Options header. I save the page. Refresh. That's it. Without content padding, complex page contents like the post module can go under the menu and it's possible to have the transparent menu effect.